Superman Driver Nation just arrived this week. I had the 2018 Volvo S90. This is the T6 all-wheel drive, a high-performance sedan that's got a lot of great luxury inside. So let's take a quick tour. The vehicle is currently locked. I have the key fob in my pocket, so I press my thumb here and pull the handle. It opens up. Check out that interior. Very nice. Yes, I have a couple of Red Bull inside already. And let's go ahead and start it up. All right, to fire it up, foot on the brake, turn this over to the right side. Drive mode's on here, I'll show you that in a second. One of my favorite features about this is the infotainment screen on the right, the instrument cluster, which is digital. A lot of cool stuff with this. It's Apple CarPlay compatible, so I have my phone set up with it. Cable's right there. Phone's not hooked up right now. And you can swipe between screens. Look at all the safety on here. Cross traffic alert, distance alert, start stop, lane keeping aid, uh, rear sunshade. I can press that, it'll, up, it'll go up and down. Heads up display, which you can, let's see, can you see it? Yeah, you gotta see it right there, heads up display. What a crummy day, it's like 44 degrees. Yeah, 44 degrees. Now I can just swipe over and check out these. This is uh, shows you the audio, Bluetooth, Apple CarPlay when I have it hooked up, the sound experience. This is one of the best parts. If you've seen any of my previous videos, you can do a concert hall. It's kind of like an echoey experience inside. I like, I like that one, so I'm gonna keep it there. Uh, going back to the start, press that button here. Steering wheel controls. This is for the audio on the entertainment system. This button here shows you the fuel economy in the digital instrument cluster. Trunk release just to the left. Really nice dials, Bowers and Wilkins sound system, which is amazing. Speaker there, speaker up front. Uh, this is your volume control here. Your drive mode dial right here. I press it in, it'll bring up on my screen here the different drive modes, eco, comfort, dynamic, and individual. This is the uh, auto start stop, so the car kind of turns off to save on fuel economy. There's your electronic park brake, cup holders, more speakers. Let's do a back seat legroom and headroom quick demo. Again, nice little luxury sedan. Here is my leg room. Holy cow, this is my position as a driver up front. So tons of room for leg space. And something was really, really cool. Let me show you on this side. So the controls here on the side, you can adjust the seat in front of you. So now the seat's moving forward. So if you want more leg room, all I'm doing is changing it right here. So maybe there's nobody in the front seat and I want to adjust it. Now I'm turning the, the up and down, back and forth. There's also the sunshade, is it this right here? Yeah, sunshade. I can do the same thing on the other side too. And behind me, I can control it over there. So if it gets too bright inside, I've got all these options to close up and uh, make yourself at home. And check out this panoramic sunroof. Isn't that nice? I like it. How much? A lot. And there are four O-Blank candles. Four of these bad boys right there. Climate controls in the middle, even USB ports, tons of space. I like this, this is cool. Let's go ahead and show the cargo demo real quick. So I just popped the trunk from the inside. Oh, I should turn the car off. <laughs> okay, that's better, that's better. Uh, I think it's in the 20 range, maybe high 20s in terms of cargo volume. Oh. Oh. Mailman coming? Yep, there's the mailman. What's up mailman, don't, don't be alarmed. Just Dave doing a ridiculous demo on the back of the Volvo. So you can almost get me back here. Let's get out before Postal Service reports me. Uh, close it up with this button here. You know, driving this is very, very sporty. Let me get to the numbers on the power and engine. So this has a two liter super and turbocharged direct injection engine, 316 horsepower. I can feel it. 295 pound-feet of torque, eight-speed automatic transmission, all-wheel drive, of course. The MSRP is just over 54,000, but as tested, we're closer to $70,000, and that's because it has the inscription trim level, which includes active bending lights, LED headlights with Thor's hammer, daytime running lights, auto high beam, 
power side support, front seats, those 19 inch 10 spoke alloy wheels in silver diamond cut, the Napa leather key fob, color coordinated inscription badge, tailgate, and in a convenience package for an extra $2,500, that inscription package, $4,500. The convenience has the heated washer nozzle, power operated trunk lid, 360 degree surround view camera, there's a few other add-ons. Oh, now it has 20-inch inscription alloy wheels. That's for an extra 800 bucks. So now we're rolling on 20s. I thought it was 19, now it's 20s. Heated steering wheel, Bowers & Wilkins premium sound for an extra 3,200 bucks. Premium air suspension in the rear for extra 1,200. Yeah, 69,140 bucks. So fuel economy, 22 city, 31 highway. I've got this thing for over a week because of the holiday, so it's gonna be fun driving this around and then giving you a recap of what it's all about. I hope you found some of that useful, and I hope you come back and see the full review in about a week and a half or so. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it if you subscribe, give it a thumbs up, comment below, and we'll see you soon. Drive safe. Adios. How do you know you're getting the best deal on a new or used car? Call 844-765-0610. Make one phone call to hear about all the great deals near you. We know all the brands and all the best deals. We're not a dealer. We're here to help you find the right car. Call 844-765-0610 today.